My name is Suhail Essa. I'm a comedian. My pronouns are this, that, and the other. I'm, I'm about to tell you about my weekend in Louis Trichard. Louis Trichard. We are on our way to Louis Trichat in Limpuapua. As uh, one young fellow said, that's how you're supposed to pronounce it. Limpuapua. I just find Limpopo. <laughs> say Limpopo for us. Just say Limpopo. I just want to hear, yeah? Limpuapua. <laughs> Don't act like you guys have heard that before. Don't act. <laughs> Limpuapua. Yeah, no, no. Not Limpopo. And definitely not Limbombo. <laughs> yeah, we're on the highway. It was a year ago when we traveled to Polokwane to do a show. Now, almost a year later, we reminisce on the near death accident that the man behind the camera had. This entire tour began probably around six weeks ago uh, when a lady, lovely lady by the name of Noshin, this lady just reached out and was like, I'm interested in doing a show and bringing you to town. Uh, what do you think? And I was like, oh, this sounds amazing. I, I wouldn't mind. People said that there was a lot of demand. So let's do it. And we just drove, stopped in Mokopane for lunch uh, with our old friend, Mohammed Ismail, also known as Pablo. <laughs> Paulo. This is Pablo. He's the braai master. We are braaiing in Mokopane today. I'm gonna try some of these beef rashes straight, fresh off the braai. Oh my God. Mm. Mm. Pablo actually hosted our show last year in Polokwane, which was a great time. But it was a great time for me, not for all of us, as you may recall from our previous vlog. Previously on the vlog. So we were on our way to Polokwane to listen to some jokes. Twice as we were trying to get off. It's a miracle I can walk. So there was an accident, uh, but we managed to do the show. Things went well. And on our way back, he said, Hey, why don't you stop in my town, Mokopane, and do another show? It's showtime okay. again. Yeah, in Mokopane. Welcome to the stage, the amazing, the great, the handsome Sohei! You uncle, uncle with Armani? No. You, you hunt? No, occasionally. Occasionally, occasionally. Yeah. He can fire with his eyes closed. Oh wow, I can see that he's got so many kids. <laughs> Thereafter, we decided to stop on our way to Louis Trichard at his home for lunch after our Juma prayer. So we had a lovely uh, um, traditional acne with lots of love and, and, and family. I then napped whilst Salman drove for pretty much the rest of the way. My name's Salman, and um, so I'm brother. I just uh, joined him on his trip just for this weekend because I was here in Joburg. So I'm excited, man. I'm tired. You came all the way from Peter Maddensburg for this. Yes, and I'm tired. I wasn't recording. Yeah, you are. I'm not even joking. <laughs> We are in Louis three, Louis Tricard, Macado. Uh, those are the three. Uh, Three bobos. What? Three bobos. Three bobos. What? Louis Three bobos. Not bad, eh? Right. Yo, that's forest, bro. Look at that. America's forest. Stay. Long story short, uh, we ended up staying at a guest house, and the guest house was fun, but I mean. The only weird thing is the guest house had decorative lamps. Literally, there were no switches in the wall, just lights. Just lights, just only lights. Um, um, there was a lamp with just a cord coming out of it. Again, just decorative, but nevertheless, uh, a good time. So we stayed there for the night, had dinner with uh, a, a, a friend's 
family. Not a family friend, a friend's family. So we had dinner there. We were hosted very well. Had a delightful meal. Uh, and there was lots of space on the table. It's respectful to keep your hat on. Is it? Yeah. So you don't want to see that ugly ass egghead of you. So I'm being disrespectful. No, not disrespectful, but it's like, it's actually advice it's to cover your hair. Questions are weird. Sure, 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 sure. Don't worry, you'll see it. At some point this weekend, it's going to shine yeah, brighter than yeah, everyone. And then that you can end up. <laughs> <laughs> and thereafter, we headed to Seattle, which is the town's famous hangout spot. Everyone goes to Seattle on the weekends, actually every night, in fact, just to hang out. They play cards, um, talk nonsense, and drink coffee. So we went there to meet our hosts of the show, Noshin and her husband, Mohsin. All right, so we're here at Seattle with Mohsin and Noshin, our hosts in Louis Tree or Louis Tree. How do you pronounce Louis Tree? I don't ask. Is it Louis? Louis Tree Chat. No. Some people say Tree Chat, some people say Tree Cat. Tricky. 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 <laughs> okay, come, let's go have a seat. I think it's load shedding at 11. The entire town switches off because the coals are wet. Uh, we had we were chatting at, at the table and one of the guys actually from from the other table noticed and spotted us so he came over and he wanted to take a picture come and to then the I, Seattle play yeah cards. it's in the hall in town come I'll give you guys you guys get an exclusive picture nobody else has yet taken a picture with me in this town <laughs> it was, don't worry. I know the population of Los Tichas how many tickets how many of you are we are seven seven, seven. all seven oh. of you are going to come so all right, we'll take, we'll take a photo now and I'll, I'll make sure I take a photo tomorrow with you guys. Also. Not today. <laughs> yeah, actually, let's do it like that. Let's come to the show tomorrow. Come to the show and I'll take a picture, picture with you. Well, I'm not then I'll make it. If I take a picture with you yeah. now, you're not going to come to the show. Uh, <laughs> What's your name? Very good business. Azu. Azu. Wait, you, you coming from a wedding or what? <laughs> oh, Friday. Hey. Oh, that's hey. a Friday. Yeah, oh. <laughs> people get dressed up to come to the Caltex. <laughs> Yo, 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 fresh, man. Check the shoes. Check, just, just zoom in on the shoes, though. <laughs> you can see, you took those out of your grandfather's cupboard. <laughs> no, but nice, man, nice. Nice. We're going to see these guys <laughs> at the show tomorrow. Must make fun of you. Oh, no. <laughs> definitely, definitely. I, I'm, I'm definitely going to make fun of Just please come with this outfit. That's all I'm asking. Come with this outfit tomorrow for the show. Yeah, no, no. Actually, bring a better one. <laughs> No, I got it, but... Uh, We're going to take lots of pictures, trust me. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have a nice conversation tomorrow. Uh, yeah, we can take a photo. Okay. Man. Tough, but you're going to come tomorrow. Yeah, yeah I'm going to see you guys. I told him to swear that he's going to come to the show tomorrow and I'll take a picture. He took a picture, he didn't come to the show. Well, I didn't see him. So if you're out there, I know who you are. I will find you. I will find you. And I will kill you. Yeah, so once we finished our little meeting, we discovered that the entire town goes into load shedding together. It's not like areas. Or, the whole town is a suburb, is the size of a suburb, pretty much. So one entire town switches off at the odd time of 11 to 1. From 11 to 1 a.m. Every single night, there was load shedding. So we experienced this firsthand. We were sitting in the garage and the lights went off. We went back to our place. Thankfully, the lights were on, except for the ones that were on the bedside. Those weren't, because there's no switch. We saw Atle. I mean, we see at Seattle coffee. We, we are we leaving now? We, we, we get in the car. It, there's load shedding. This is the only place with lights in the whole town. The whole town is just switched off. So it's time to go to bed. See you tomorrow. Hey, come on, man. Subscribe. Then share the video and click like. You know you want to. New videos dropping weekly.